Welcome to another episode of Your Time Matters. I am your host, Tamron, joining you here each week with a cup of delicious healthy tea. And I'm going to encourage you to stay tuned until the end of this video as I share why I chose one specific ingredient inside my teacup this week to help me stay emotionally balanced based on what's currently happening in the astrological sky. As one of Canada's top certified astrologers and a certified health coach, I'm here to guide you and educate you about what is currently happening in the sky and how it might be showing up in our personal life and on an emotional level, meaning how we might be feeling for this week ahead. And we just had that new moon energy where the sun and the moon come together in the sign of Taurus. Now, remember, Taurus represents an earth element. It represents our money and our values, what we stand for when it comes to that relationship with money. But it's also an earth sign. So it also represents anything to do with our food and anything that comes from nature. So it's the perfect time under this new moon energy to start planning or start planting some of our items inside of our garden. So it's interesting how this always lines up with astrology as well. But what I'm here to share with you is that for the entire month of May, we are going to be experiencing events that might be occurring in our personal life that are being triggered by the planet of Jupiter. Now, why is this happening? It's because the planet of Jupiter and Uranus have been coming together in the astrological sky. But we are also going to see other planets move across where Jupiter and Uranus have been sitting together in the sky. And this is going to trigger and activate very specific areas of everyone's life regarding the themes of what these other planets, such as the sun and Venus, and also where the moon has been crossing over this, this area of Jupiter and Uranus together. Now, I don't want to confuse you. I just want to keep this simple. But because it's going to be activating the planet Jupiter, and Jupiter represents joy and hope and optimism, opportunities and growth. It's that area of our life that expands. So in one specific area of your life, you might experience new opportunities, new growth, just something sudden out of the blue coming up and happening for you. And it's an opportunity for you to take it. So with this week ahead, I am encouraging everyone to stay optimistic, even when it's just at the, you know, you're just feeling like things aren't showing up the way you want it. Maybe the universe is going to give you that gift of something in a way that you never, ever possibly imagined. So I want you to remain optimistic and joyful. So you want to feel really confident this month. And I have put Tulsi tea as the herbal tea inside of my teacup this week because it has that emotional healing property of confidence. And that is exactly how I want you to feel this week. And I've also added a dash of raw honey only to enhance, not only to enhance the flavor, but to give even my immune system a great big boost. And also, I'm going to encourage you to use high-grade essential oils this month as well to give you that uplifting feeling, that sense of joy and optimism. And not only is it just one essential oil, but if you combine two very specific essential oils and bring them together, I'm going to ask you to use or recommend that you use peppermint and orange or a wild orange together. Now, because these are very common essential oils, you can use them with a carrier oil and you can apply them to your wrist area or the nape of your neck, or you can apply the peppermint and the orange directly into some type of a diffuser where you can pick up on the aroma that is inside of your room because peppermint and wild orange together are very optimistic, 
hopeful and joyful. So with a combination of essential oils and having Tulsi tea in your teacup, you are going to be like riding on that sense of hope and optimism for the whole month ahead. So if you've never tried this before, I'm going to encourage you to do so. And always, I want to encourage you to take an action step. And that really is to learn how to start trusting your intuition and your intuitive download. So I'm going to encourage you to use some form of a guided journal or an open journal where you can just write down anything that you're hearing in your dreams or in your meditations, or sometimes people receive signs and messages when they're out walking. And sometimes many of us, we find coins and money or feathers. And I just want to remind you to pay attention when that happens and pay attention to what you're thinking. And if you're feeling anything negative, then I'm going to encourage you to use what it is that I've recommended for you this month. And also, if you're going to write anything down, is to write down in the color of blue, because blue has a very positive and healing energy associated with it. It's more of a protective energy, and black is very negative. So I always continue to write in blue pen inside of my guided journals. And remember, this is going to occur for the entire month of May. So stay optimistic, stay hopeful, and remember that many of us are going to experience these new doors or opportunities in one specific area of our lives. And as always, if you've enjoyed the information that I've shared with you here this week, I'm going to encourage you to come back again for another episode of Your Time Matters. If you are a woman and you are either in the Southern Ontario area where I've been traveling and visiting for the last couple of months and you'd love to connect with me, I'm offering different types of events and still offering private astrology consultations. So you can meet me live in person here in Georgetown till the end of May, or also you can still purchase a virtual astrology consultation where I can look at some very specific signatures in your astrological logical birth chart and guide you so that you are more aligned with your higher purpose because sometimes we just need a little nudge or a little message from a certified astrologer to guide you to take those opportunities or to align with is truly meant for you and it is when it's what is going to make you feel more fulfilled fulfilled in this lifetime. So the links are associated below this video, wherever you're seeing it on social media. I encourage you to click on it and connect with me. And I look forward to meeting you somewhere inside of my community. Cheers for now. Bye-bye.